Good morning, welcome to another edition of Pernoya Mornings. I'm RJ Lang. I wanted to share with you today that uh, in the end of our simplification theme or week, there's one thing that you need to consider, one of them being uh, that you must remove the good to get to the great. So this is a concept that's really difficult because when things are going good, you feel that the process is moving along property, properly and you're getting to your goals. But I want to relate this to the aspect of a great bicycle. Like if I'm doing a bike race or I'm doing a triathlon and I have a good bike like the one I have currently, I can, no matter how hard I'm working, I can... That, you know, if the components and the bike itself are good, I'm never going to be great. I'm just going to be to the level that the equipment allows me to. So keep that in mind when you're simplifying your life and removing things that uh, are negative first off and then focusing on uh, Pareto's principle of the 80-20 rule that 80% uh, of your success is coming from 20% of the things that you're doing throughout the day. Uh, and this is you know, widespread throughout most of the things you do in your career as well, uh, in your workouts, and, and so on. So you must remove the good to get to the great. So if I were to have that Quintana Roo that I posted about that I really like that I want to use for uh, the Arizona Ironman, I'm going to have to get rid of the uh, Kestrel here uh, to change it up to the great. So, and then I could probably see that my efforts are going to be focused a lot better and I'll see my miles per hour, my pace, and my times get a lot better as well as my overall timing. So, I hope this helps you today and it's not what I do or say that you're going to remember, but the way I make you feel. Thank you.